Hey, how's it going, guys? Appreciate it. Let's shoot for something like 2,000, 3,000, 10 million, whatever it might be. If you like the video and you want to support my channel, please drop a like. I would really appreciate it, guys. Other than that, let's get started. So I'm basing this speculation off some new information that has come up from some pretty reputable sources, which of course I'll have in the description, and of course other Rockstar games that I have played in the past. So of course all you guys probably know of the casino and horse track that is right now empty, and it just says coming soon. And we don't really know what's going on over there, we don't really know what Rockstar's plan is to open it, but... Knowing Rockstar, if they put something in the game and add that much detail to it, it's likely that they're going to use it. It's probably a good fact that they didn't put that casino in there just for really good aesthetics and really good looks. They probably are going to end up using that one way or another down the line. Now, there were some recent things that came up, and I'll put it on the screen right now, and it's some code that was found within the game, and it is reset underscore roulette, stop underscore roulette, and then set underscore roulette underscore outcome. Now, if you don't know, roulette is a very popular gambling game that is very much set on chance, where essentially you pick a color, red or black, and if it lands, it's like a spinning wheel, and if the ball lands on red or black or whatever one you choose, you win money, and if it doesn't, you lose. It's a very simple gambling game that is very pop popular around the world, and uh, it's one that I think we're going to be seeing in GTA Online. Now, as far as other game modes, uh, going back to Red Dead Redemption, I believe there was standard... Texas Hold'em and Blackjack don't like officially count me on that information because I know it's been a few years since I played Red Dead Redemption so I might not be the best source uh, for what gambling was in their game but I know there was gambling and I know it wasn't roulette stuff so I guarantee you we're going to be seeing roulette, poker, maybe even some sorts of uh, slot machines and blackjack and of course this is something that Rockstar can easily incorporate because this kind of drives their shark card sales. If you're going to be gambling your GTA money away, you're eventually going to need to get a fix for that need, and you're probably going to end up buying more shark cards. So this is a win-win situation for us. We get really cool gambling mechanics and uh, casino lifestyle, and of course, Rockstar will eventually benefit by giving the community something really nice and, of course, giving us a nice add-on that I know we all want to see. So definitely let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below about uh, you know the casino and the gambling lifestyle and hopefully uh, something that comes soon of that. I definitely want to hear from you guys on that issue. And be sure to not only leave a like if you did enjoy, but subscribe if you want to see all my daily GTA 5 videos and other gaming content. Other than that, guys, like I said, thanks for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.